This is in no way my attempt to justify my comic book obsession. And this story, I really, really like. Artwork, the storytelling. Hello and welcome to another episode of The Pull List. My name is Travis. Let's talk about the Gambit movie. 20th Century Fox just released a more detailed future release schedule for movies and Gambit wasn't on the list. Gambit's original release date was October 7th, 2016, this year, and nope, not anymore. Even more so, they have yet to shoot a single frame of this movie. Nothing is getting done. Production was set to begin this month, but that's a very teeny tiny window to shoot and edit and produce and release a movie all in seven months. Teeny tiny. And this film has not had an easy life to the screen. Just last year at San Diego Comic-Con, Channing Tatum showed up at a Marvel Fox promotion, but his role wasn't confirmed until a few weeks later, after which it was rumored that he was just gonna leave the project but then his role was confirmed. And then director Rupert Wyatt walked away from the project due to scheduling conflicts, but there are reports saying that it was probably like a budget issue. And then Fox snagged Born Identity, Edge of Tomorrow director Doug Lehman, but there's such a small window to get everything done, it makes sense why there might be a delay. They probably definitely need to rework some things. New director, new budget, new universe. A lot has changed since Gambit's brief appearance in X-Men Origins Wolverine. The actor, most notably. But does this mean we're going to get a Gambit movie in 2017? 18? Ever? Are we ever going to see a Gambit movie? Maybe Fox just didn't want to overload the boat with X-Men this year. You have Deadpool, X-Men Apocalypse, that's a lot of X-Men all in one year. Or maybe Deadpool had a very positive effect, showing Fox that they don't need to make some crazy mad dash to create a character in the X-Men movies for people to rally behind, to create a household name from. It's obvious to Fox now that people love Deadpool, so they don't have to stress so much because Wolverine is leaving the building. And here's hoping that after the success of Deadpool, Fox is working to create a gambit that's very faithful to the source material. Please. But please do not make a rated R gambit. All this talk of rated R movies, can you imagine a rated R Gajan gambit just throwing cards, cutting people's heads off? <laughs> no. Please no. In the comments down below, let me know your thoughts of Channing Tatum starring as Gambit. I know there's been a lot of talk about this for the last year, but do you think he's right for the role, or do you think the studios just picked a Channing Tatum type actor for star power? Do you think he's a great fit for the role, or do you think he's horribly miscast? And how do you think his accent's gonna be? That's the part that a lot of people are waiting for. Anyway, that's it for this episode of The Pool List. My name is Travis, thank you for fueling my comic book obsession, and you will see me soon.